So fun facts. Now I have over 50, um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Consecutive, uh, Spider-Man issues in order. Jeez. Yep. Makes me a happy, happy man. And people say you have no life. <laughs> yeah, it either means I've got much more than other people say or much less. I've discovered a bunch of enemies. Yeah, oh. there's a lot of dudes over here. It's a whole army! Oh my god, I've got to haunt more people. I'm not haunting dudes enough. But whatever they offer you, don't feed your butt. Well, that's generally good advice. <laughs> if you don't want to get some diseases. But if that's your thing, you can. It's just you need to take the proper precautions. Of course. When it comes to butt feeding. Also, you don't want to hurt your butt either. So make sure to feed it the proper food as well. It, it's not all about you. It's not a one-way street. Of course. Gotta think of the butt. I always think of the butt. <laughs> The Archon abilities are Arcane Blast, Explosion, Arcane Strike, Jump AoE Attack, Disintegration Ray, Laser of Destruction, Slow Time, Requires Rune, Teleportation Requires Rune. That's cool. Unfortunately, I've got a feeling I'm probably never going to play Diablo 3 ever again after we beat this. <laughs> and Reapers of Souls. I'm sure we'll, we'll come back for Reapers of Souls and play that on stream. Um... I really wish it was a musical version just called Reapers of Soul. No. <laughs> That's what I have to say to that. Um <clears throat> But this game's this game's fun. I'm just not incredibly into it. Do we talk to this lady now or do we go up top? Oh, she just has regular things to say. Boring. It should have said the unknown depths part two. Yeah. The slightly less unknown but still quite mysterious depths. The more unknown depths because you've explored the other depths. But whatever they offer you, don't take off your pants. Oh, too late. <laughs> I've taken off my shirt. Uh, I'm not wearing clothes. Oh, really? Is Matt in the room with you still? No. Oh. <laughs> Actually, I might, have to I might have to take him to Bart soon, so we might have to call it early. I was gonna actually say call it, um, once we finish this area. Like, okay. go through whatever this section is, probably make that man spin a circle with a ball in the middle, and then go down that final hallway, which will probably be a boss. You have enough time for that? Don't know. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. I said that in a weird way. <laughs> it's like, we'll see. We'll see. Um, what else is I going to say? Oh my god, so many units. I've really enjoyed playing Diablo uh, 3 Live. I will say, thank god I have you here. <laughs> <laughs> Because otherwise, I, I don't, I, I don't think this is my kind of game. I'll just say that. Oh my God! So many enemies everywhere. Oh my God. After we play, I, I don't think I'd want to do this immediately after we finish this game, though. Uh, especially, obviously, since both, both, both of us are gonna be busy going back to school eventually. But um. Or before too long. But, um... After we finish this, um... Would you be interested in playing, uh... Torchlight 2? Which is literally... Same type of gameplay style, but, um... Made by an indie team. I don't know. I mean, uh, obviously I'll, there's I'll also... i think about it. Yeah. Obviously there's also a shit ton, ton of other games, uh... That we could play. But I, I, I've been interested in that one for a while because it was pretty well received when it came out. Oh, a treasure, a treasure chest. 
It was funny to play multi, mul multiple times. It gets harder every time you go through it. It does? That's nice. But yeah, uh... I'll consider it. I agree. I, I definitely... I mean, I don't think this is in any regards not uh, common knowledge, but Diablo 3 is definitely a multiplayer game. I, meaning, em it emphasizes on the multiplayer rather than single player, I'd say. Frost Lurker. I like these weird glowing rocks that are chilling in the back. Or slabs, I should say. Slabs the killer, to be precise. <laughs> we didn't play Bang the last time we hung out. We need well, to play that. Then we must bang again. We'll always bang. Really, we don't bang enough. True. You should tell Matt that. I will. We, we never bang enough. Oh yeah, um, are you doing anything tomorrow? Uh, from two to, to, to three, I think? I've got a meeting. What, uh, what for? Uh, your job? Uh, nah. Uh, it's, uh, mandatory therapy from, uh, taking a leave of absence. <laughs> oh, okay. But, um, pretty much completely done with that. Okay, because Matt was suggesting that we do another get-together, uh, tomorrow. I know it's last minute, but that would be fun. Uh-huh. Yeah, um, I, I'd be fine with that. Part of me is like, oh, final day off before going back to work, but I, I would love to do that. Okay, we'll figure out the details. Oh, yeah. I'll have my Especially since we don't have uh, too much time to hang out anymore, I imagine, unfortunately. True. True, true. It's the true, true train. <laughs> I thought that you'd be happy, but now that I know you're not. You're more to life than that. So ask me not, or something like that. I completely missed that. I don't... I was just singing the lyrics, but I don't oh. know them. And Dean just sent a text. I, I saw it too. I was like, what the hell's going on there? I think he might be listening in on us. <laughs> He's the NSA. He is the enemy. We must destroy him. We'll have to play Evolution since I got it. Evolution is really fun. I really, really like Evolution. Sure. True train. Oh okay. my god. Okay, I, I I'm starting to vote for just find the exit. I just skipped that room of enemies. Oh, that's something I just discovered. That that I ran past them? One thing I love about this vault okay, this thing is, is that when I vault chest. over enemies, I just stun them. You stun? Oh my god! Okay, that was a trap! You stun enemies when you vault over them. Oh, thank god we went the right way. That's cool, though. There's a book. I want the XP. Yeah! I need the ability where, by turning into a skeleton, I stun people. There's so many enemies constantly everywhere. Oh. Go away, little thing. It's me talking to, to my dick. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was hilarious. <laughs> this game. Okay, I think this is the exit. Oh my god, just leave. So much! We're almost there, Brendan. Oh my god, it's a dead end! Turning around. <laughs> Don't panic. <laughs> Run, me! Never stop! Oh, this area is a disaster! Oh my god! Did you throw me? Nope. I just got I think tossed. That was one of the enemies. That's really cool that there are enemies that throw you. Can you particularly guys... Oh, fuck. A particularly considered enemy. Oh my god, go! It's so hard to maneuver when clicking on enemies forces you to attack. I mean, in all fairness, it is so hard to maneuver when you're trying actively to avoid playing the game. I mean, yeah, that's <laughs> true. Oh, chest. you're kidding me. There's just two treasure chests here! 
Have we not gone up? Like, northwest? Oh, uh, we haven't okay. gone... Okay, we haven't gone northeast. Yes! Uh, oh, it was right there. That's so okay, BS. Okay, need to go now. Okay, I was gonna say, we, we, this is a perfectly fine spot to leave it off because there's probably a boss after this. Uh, right, so that'll be excitement for that boss fight or whatever. Look at this thing! Ooh, That's ooh, cool yeah. looking. That's gotta be a boss. But yeah, we'll leave that for the excitement of next time or whatever. Oh no, the alien girl! You just came in right when we're about to end it. That's so sad. Thank you for coming out, though. It's been way too long since I've streamed, so I appreciate uh, still keeping me in mind and stuff like that, of course. Oh, stretch. All right, uh, Rob, you haven't officially left, right? No, I have. Uh, I meant the, the chat, uh, so obviously no. <laughs> uh, people are telling me to check my abilities, so I'll go ahead and do that for now. Got two new things. Well, you could head out whenever you want. Thank you so much for joining. It was uh, a really fun stream. I'll be looking yep, forward to when we was. do it again next time. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Until next time. Rah. Brad, uh, Evolution is a uh, board game or a tabletop game where basically you're trying to um, make the... You're competing against other players to make a spe species that do the best at surviving. Um, either by being herbivores that are able to eat the most food and prosper, prosper the most, or making carnivores that um, are able to eat lesser herbivores or weaker uh, alternate carnivores. And basically, by the end of it, whoever collects the most food wins, uh, essentially. But it's really cool and it's got a lot of depth to it and it's play style it's really cool uh next stream is probably going uh, I, I right now see this is the hard thing i um i want to stream as frequently as possible but it's a little bit impossible to be completely honest uh because i work three days a week and then i've got my life outside of that i'm working on developing a, a board game with my older sister um, so I try to dedicate time to that, even though I haven't in a long, long while. Um, so right now my plan is stream once every week. Um, uh, so it'll probably be sometime next week. We'll have to see. Um, I would say probably, probably Wednesday again, to be completely, to be honest. Uh, oh, you just woke up early, a alien girl. Is it early for you or did you take a nap or something? Or a super late day. I, I've had a lot of those in my life. Let's go ahead and check out all these abilities. Uh, fetish uh, psychopaths. That's actually pretty amazing. When you hit enemies with your spell, you have a 15% chance to summon a dagger-wielding fetish to fight by your side for 60 seconds. That's almost certainly what I'm going with. That sounds amazing. Or reduce the cooldown of your horrify. Spirit walk and soul harvest spells by 2 seconds. That could be really, really good, but... I barely use that stuff anyways. What was this one? That one's really... No, that's the one that I don't like. Yeah, so we're going for fetish psychopaths. Because, like I said, it sounds unbelievably awesome. Um... And then... Fire bats, plague bats, disease bats fly towards the enemies and infect, infect them. We'll go ahead and stick with this double, uh... Haunt one because you said that's good. Spirit walk. Oh shoot! Gain mana when you activate spirit walk. That's so bad. I I like being a purple skeleton. Incre increase the duration of it. Um, and then acid cloud. Lob blob bomb. That's so good. The acid on the ground forms into a slime that poisons nearby enemies before going away. I think we gotta do our zombie pile on. And then, oh shoot, we got a new ability for the Gargantuan and Fetish Army! What is this? Summon an army of dagger-wielding fetishes. Cooldown 120. Do these guys have a duration for how long they last? Let's see. Oh my lord. Okay. Uh. <laughs> oh, what? don't know what's better the gargantuan or this there's so many of them this i think i have to go with this just because i want as many 
slaves as human. Oh, they go away though. Never mind. We're going with a gargantuan. If gargantuan, if these guys die, I'm definitely going with gargantuan. Or I should say, if those guys are on a timer, I'm definitely going with the gargantuan. Let's look at our badass helmet. Uh, it's not quite as cool as I thought it would be, but it's still pretty cool. Um. Oh, stretch my. I mean, scratch my back. So I could actually uh bring up an idea that me and my older sister have been talking about for a while while I wait for this fetish army to cool down. Uh, me and her are actually thinking of uh, starting a YouTube channel focused all about board games and stuff like that. I don't know if you guys would be excited about that. That's something that I'm definitely really excited about and would love to um, uh, work on in the future because board games are really, really cool and we're in the middle of what is kind of like a board game renaissance, to be completely honest. There's a lot of really cool and exciting um, board games that are, are coming out nowadays um, that are really innovative and awesome, and they're rather unknown and obscure, and I'd, I'd love to spread the word about that. Like, if, if video games are still just, like, honestly starting uh, to get big and huge um as time goes on uh but board games are are still currently way way behind video games uh in regards to popularity and and growth amongst people and stuff like that and i i think they deserve a lot more um of a following because like i said there's a lot of really really cool games coming out right now hell i'm i'm trying to work on one <laughs> Yeah, glad to hear you love board games, Brad. That's awesome. Like I said, there's a lot of really, really cool board games coming out right now. So that's one thing that me and my older sister have been thinking about for quite some time. Oops, wrong button. Go to skills. Let's go ahead and check out our Gargantuan. Did uh, Humanoid, the Gargantuan gains a cleave ability, allowing him to attack multiple enemies. That's really good. So is this bear. Gargantuan encounters an elite enemy... Uh, or is surrounded it enrages gaining bonus movement and attack elite enemies include champions rares bosses and other players is that better than a cleave probably yeah I, I would say probably so let's get that that sounds awesome because obviously the cleave means he's better against a, a greater number of enemies but this this means he'll be stronger against a greater number and single opponents so that's cool that's cool and cleave one on one like against bosses would be awful. N Trove. I may have seen Trove before, but that's not one that I've heard of. Let me see. Trove. Um. Images. Google search. Oh. Oh. The, this is. A, I, I thought that was a board game. Um. Yeah, I saw photos of this, but I, I know nothing about it. Obviously, the graphics are very Minecraft-esque in regards to it being a cube world. But is this, uh, like a survival crafting game? When it enrages, it gets huge? Oh, that's awesome. I need to stick with that then. So definitely enrage. Enrage is going to be the way to go. It, oh, it's an MMO. That's interesting. I wouldn't have expected that. Might might check in about that if if it's cool. Mm. Is it free? Um, I know it's on Steam, I believe. But uh, that's something that I'd have to, might have to check out then sometime. You should have a really overpowered ability in one of them. Oh, and wait. Oh, check the final ability of one of the skill sets. Okay. I, do I have any final abilities in any others? I'm not sure. I think... I'm pretty sure the only one I have is the... Uh, okay, so Cancel Keeps It is where I want it to be. I think the only one that I have the final ability now is the Gargantuan, and that's... That's crazy! Because the Gargantuan was, well, the, uh, is the four ability slot, the final one. Oh, wait. No, I don't. I'm an idiot. Why do I think I had the final ability? Unless... 
Yeah. I don't know why I thought that. I'm I'm a silly man. Restless giant. Keep that. Um. Unless you mean these final abilities. Then I actually do have final abilities in a lot of those. But I, I'm pretty sure you meant rune. Uh, yes it is free. Okay, that's cool. Alright, yo. Well, I think that's actually going to be it for the stream, guys and gals. So thank you all for chilling with me. I had a lot of fun with this stream in particular. Voice is getting a little bit sore, so I'm uh, somewhat glad it's done. But I uh, wish it could go on longer as well. Uh, because I love hanging with you guys so much. But anyways, as I was saying, that's going to be it. Thank you all for watching. Uh, for all of those watching the VODs on YouTube, if you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like, a comment, and or subscribing if you have not. I am the Egg Scrambled Gamer, and I will see you all in the next one. See you guys! Oh god, <laughs> like a burped there. Bye bye Okay, so you did mean abilities, not runes. Then I do have a lot of final abilities. Uh, but I don't know. I, I, I like the Gargantuan because he's so big over the fetish army. Um, Mass Confusion, I bet Mass Confusion is much better than Sacrifice. But I like exploding dogs, even though I barely use them. It's so cool. Piranhas, I think I would love to use. Um, summons a pool of deadly piranhas that deals damage and causes affected units to take additional damage. Okay, so it's a pool. So I guess that would combo well with the Grasp of Dead ability if I wanted to use that? Have I used Swarm of Locusts? I think I did and I was a little bit underwhelmed, but I'm not sure. And Firebomb, I could understand that being really good, but I love the toads because they're adorable. I love toads. Uh, if you get Trove, my name is the same as here. Oh, okay, cool. If I get Trove, I'll definitely, um, uh, again, contact you and we could play some or something like that. But anyways, like I said, that's going to be it for the stream. Thank you for coming out, Brad. Thank you as well for everyone else. It was a really fun stream. And I'll see you all sometime later. Bye-bye.